What's up guys, this is Jesse. Um, I just picked up this game on Steam. Actually, I was going to buy the full version, but I decided to play the demo, which is this right here. Um, yeah, and I just played the demo. It was interesting. There's, a, there's, I just played this game. There's a whole lot of insight. It tells you exactly what the game's going to be like. I hope you guys enjoy this video. Um, yeah, it's going to be interesting. Alright, what's up guys? This is the Stanley Parable uh, demo. I just got, I picked this up, actually I was looking at uh, the Stanley Parable on Steam and I saw the demonstration and I thought I might as well just play the demonstration first to get a get a good idea before I buy the game. Um, the demo's free on Steam and the game is only like eleven ninety nine. It's just a, a little mod to another game so it's, it's pretty cheap. Um, we will begin the demo. So basically this game is kind of a mindfuck. Um, so what, so what it's about is um, you're just some guy and basically your whole life is being controlled by other people. Like everything that you do was like programmed and told, you know, like you do what you're told. So this is kind of your um, opportunity to go against what you've been told your whole life and basically try to escape. So... This loading screen is taking forever, so I don't really know what else to say. I guess we'll find out what the demo, what the demo's like, and then if we like the demo, we will uh, go ahead and play the real game. Uh, yeah, go ahead and leave a leave a comment in the section below if you guys if you guys want to see the real game or if you know what the real game is. Apparently, it came out yesterday, so and it's getting like some mad raves or mad reviews, so that's why I decided to get it. All right, the Stanley Parable demonstration. I can move. Okay. Was I just staring at a wall? <laughs> okay. No parking. Why is my mouse here? Am I supposed to have a mouse? I don't think so. I don't know if you guys can see my mouse, but it's on the in the middle of my screen. Uh, the Stanley Parable demonstration this way. It's really strange that my mouse is here. I hope you guys can't see it. Let me see here. Uh, keyboard mouse. Uh, reverse mouse. Mouse sensitivity. Huh. It doesn't say. I can't get rid of it. Alright. We'll just keep on playing. Uh, so. This. This is going to be my opportunity to. Welcome to the Stanley Parable demonstration. Hey. Your number is 28. When your number is displayed, please enter the demonstration room. Thank you, and have a pleasant demonstration. Who? Who's talking to me? Okay, so freakily enough, that was my, uh... That's my volleyball number back in season. Okay. Please wait for your number and then enter. Oh, I can enter here. So nobody's here. And it's 20. So here is my first opportunity to basically go against what I've been told just now. So nobody else is here. I could just go in if I wanted to. But I think I'm going to play it safe. Because every uh, action comes with a reaction. Uh, equal and opposite reaction, whatever. But it's usually kind of negative if you go against the story. So for now, I'm going to stick with uh, with waiting my turn. Stanley Parable demo. Well, someone must have been so excited. The demo must be amazing. Oh, one more. Don't want to cross the line. Hello? Go! Famous demos. So these are other games. I think that's Splinter Cell. Yeah. I'm not quite sure what that one is. That looks like a Pokeball. Okay. All right. So this oh, is. Hello, hello, oh, hello, hello. Welcome to the Stanley Parable live demonstration. Yeah. It will be my pleasure to guide you through this sneak peek at what to expect in the Stanley Parable. A tease, just enough to leave you hungry for more. How oh, exciting! Well, thank you. Can't you just feel that nervous tension? 
the looming uncertainty? Why don't we drink in the anticipation for a moment, just for 20 minutes or so? What? Please, for just 20 minutes, don't move or act in any way. Simply remain motionless and let the thrill of demoing the Stanley Parable wash over you. Well, all right. I mean, we, we did say we'd stay, you know, we'd, we'd go along with the course of the story, so I guess we're going to have to sit here for 20 minutes then. Fuck that. Oh, I get it. You're too anxious. You can barely hold still. Yeah. I'll tell you what. I think we should walk off that nervous energy before getting the demo underway. Okay. Here, why don't I take you on a little tour of the facility? Oh. And show you how we make a demonstration for a game like the Stanley Parable. All right. This is where I and the other proctors have been working meticulously to construct a demo that explains clearly and concisely exactly what the Stanley Parable is, how it plays, <laughs> and why you should spend real-world money on the main game. What? Video game demonstrations are tricky, and without the proper technology, you run the risk of the player having no idea what to expect in the full version. Well, yeah, I mean, I, I, that's why I'm playing this. I want to know... What's going on? Oh god, a lot of bad things going on. A lot of bad things. Okay. Oh, the clock's working. Oh, that'd be so creepy if it was the time that it is right now, but that's not what time it is. Oh, this mouse in my in the middle of my screen is so annoying. It's fine. Ah, here is one such technology. These buttons are meant to convey the meaning of choice and the impact of the decisions you make. After all, choices carry tremendous meaning and consequence. Didn't you know that? Oh, Go yeah. Ahead. Why don't you try picking one of these buttons to press, and we'll see what your choice says about you. Oh, God. There's nothing even on them. Is there a button back here? No. Um... Well, if I pick one on the low one, I bet... But yeah, anyway, so this is the whole decision-making. That's what this whole game's about. Like, it all affects what goes on. Exactly like in uh, The Walking Dead, if you had been following that. So, we're gonna... We're gonna pick one. What happened? Well, I clicked on one. Now my mouse is gone, so that's good. I clicked on one, and it, like, froze. How fascinating. Did you know that 94% of all people who select that particular button are sexual predators? What? You see, our choices what? really do illuminate the very intangible nature of our minds and souls. No, click another one. Pervert. What? Oh, 94% of people who pick that button are perverts. Or sexual predators. Okay. Bastards. What else can I show you then? This place is the buffalo of game design. Nothing is wasted. The buffalo of game design. Let's do wall technology. Now, I think you'll find this exciting. We've actually developed a wall that you can walk through. Go ahead. Give it a shot. Okay. Oh. Ow. Hmm. Guess it's still in development. Oh. Okay, moving along. <laughs> you fucking bastard. Okay. Good. How's the anticipation? Still feeling it? I'm freaking out. The Stanley Parable Demo Construction Facility. Oh, this is Final Choice. Let's, let's not walk into there yet. Emotion booths. Now, here's what we use to convey story. These booths convert text from a story into raw emotion. Go ahead, step into one of them, and feel the sheer power of narrative exposition. Well, I think this is one of the most... Can I get in this one? No? I gotta go in one of these? Oh no, let's, let's do despair. Where did these cliffs go? These crags that we stood upon, they shielded us from our own ignorance, spoke coddling words and wrapped our vulnerabilities in a woolen cloth that so many times I tried to set aflame. If I knew these comforts now, would their fibers be any more sensitive to the heat of Okay. I can't handle any of that. That was horrible. Uh, let's do discovery. It was though, oh my god. Within the shame he carried that ocean breeze did drift. The fierceness Falling of twice. the tides. 
the are failing twice. The collapse of their kingdoms, washed ashore, bereft of shame, martyrs devoid of a cause, ripping and tearing at the eternal. Oh my God, those are horrible. Is there any more? Now, now oh. we have to save at least a few emotions for the full game. Oh, bastards! Okay, let's move on. Oh, What's you that? went in both booths? Yeah. Oh, how vulnerable of you! If at any point during the demo you need to cry, just let me know, and we can take a minute. I don't cry for no one. Oh, look, it's art. Beautiful. Okay. Fragile. Okay. Let's go to the compliments. One of the most important parts of administering any demonstration is pumping up your ego and appealing to insecurities about your sense of self-worth. Oh my god. That's why we use this room to develop cheap compliments to shower on the player during the demo. Go ahead and press that button to see some of the superficial flattery we've been cooking up. That's a frowny face. My heavens, I've never met someone who can consume as much uranium in a single sitting as you can. Just look at you go. Um. Okay. Of all the people I know who are playing this exact demo at this exact moment and standing in this exact room, your performance is easily in the top 5,000. <laughs> top 4,700 even. I won't go as far as 4,600. You sly bastard. Hmm. Uh, let's see. Oh, this is embarrassing. I really can't think of anything else to say. Uh, no, no. You've really exhausted my list of compliments. Goodness, that was fast. Either you or this department has a lot of room for improvement. Okay then, what's next? You smart ass. Can I press it again? You've got a truckload of compliments here and you can't give me two, three? Truckloads. Truckloads of compliments. Alright, whatever. At least now I know what to expect in that department of the game. Alright. This device tells you whether or not you're inside a video game demonstration. Somewhere around here, there's also a device that tells you whether or not you're inside a device that tells you whether or not you're inside a video game demonstration. <laughs> Inception! Well, it would appear that the demonstration is not in progress. Hello? Okay. Okay. What's left? The final choice. What's over here? Uh. Ah, now this room is perhaps the most important you'll encounter in the demo. This is where we determine whether or not the demo has been effective. Whether it's conv No! Oh what are you my doing? God! You that decision yet? You haven't played the demo. We've put so much work into this demonstration. <laughs> Wouldn't it be a shame if you rushed right into making a purchasing decision without savoring it first? Let this one simmer. You'll have plenty of time to decide later. Fuck, that actually scared me <laughs> so much. What did I just walk into? The exit. And there you have it. Everything you need to know about how video game demos are made. Okay. All right. However, it's still important that we address safety concerns. Please closely observe the following possible negative side effects of playing the Stanley Parable. If you agree to be held 100% responsible for oh my any God. and all injury or long-term damage, mental, physical, or otherwise, that may occur while playing the demo, please do not press the large red glowing disagree button at this time. Nothing? What? No objections? You're quite sure about that? Well, all right then. Oh, In no. the event that you do experience one or all of the previously listed symptoms, let's establish a signal for you to convey to me that you wish the demonstration to be terminated. Please step into the dance perimeter. What? Please perform a dance. Oh, oh, oh yeah. The best. Your dance has been recorded. 
Yeah. In the event that you feel confused or disoriented by anything you see inside the demo, perform that dance and I will terminate the demo immediately. Okay. Right. All preparations have been made. It is time at <laughs> last. Are you prepared for the Stanley Parable? Yay! <gasps> what? I'm confused. Dance. Okay. Um, okay. What? Oh wait, what? What are we doing Welcome here? Welcome to the we Stanley not... Parable demonstration. Your number is 29. When your number is displayed, please enter the demonstration room. Thank you, and have a pleasant demonstration. Okay. All right. Okay, uh, I'm lost. Let's just get back to the green room and start the demo again. I must have done something wrong the first time. All right, well, I'm not waiting. Hello? Okay, here we go. The Stanley Parable Demo Take Two. Finding the demo, learning exactly what the Stanley Parable is. Here it comes. Yay! All right, let's do this again. The Stanley Parable. Oh wait, what's this? Plywood. It's just sticks of plywood. Eight. Eight. What? Wait, 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 wait! It's this is all wrong. This isn't the Stanley eight. Parable. This is a game eight. where you press a button and it says eight. It's amazing. Not only is the Stanley Parable not a game about continuously pressing the number eight, eight I can guarantee eight, that this eight, button does not appear anywhere in the eight, main game. Why is eight, it here instead of the demo for the Stanley Parable? Where did the demo go? Eight, there was an actual eight, demo here before. Something has gone wrong. It's it all behind? gone horribly wrong. We need to get you out of here before you start forming impressions of the Stanley Parable based eight. on whatever the hell this eight game is. We need to get out. Eight. We need to start over. You eight. mustn't stay here another eight. minute. Out, out, eight. out. Go, go, go. But I eight. like this game. Eight. So far, it's been better than this whole demo. Eight. Now, I think perhaps you've misunderstood me, so let me reiterate as clearly as I can. This is not the Stanley Parable. What you are eight. doing is pushing a button over and over eight. that does nothing but speak the word eight. eight. Has that gotten through? You may be continuing eight. to press this button under eight. the impression you're playing the Stanley Parable right now. It says. An assumption that is, I should remind you again, eight. entirely erroneous. But. Eight. It says. Eight. Says it's a Stanley Parable. Eight. I like this game. It doesn't even make sense. Why would I have gone to all of this elaborate eight. setup just to demonstrate a game that doesn't do a single thing except repeat the word eight? The waiting room, the green room, the tour of the facility, all of that for no reason eight. other than to contextualize and eight. build up this particular game. Why? What about Why? this game deserves any of that time and attention? Are you eight. seeing something in it that I'm not? Eight. Oh yeah, look how smooth. Eight. Look at that button movement. A lot of work eight. has gone into this. Eight. All right, that's fine. All right, let's go back. Liars. Imagine if this had oh. been the demo. What would you have been thinking? You'd have left with no idea what the Stanley Parable is about. None whatsoever. Exactly. I would have thought it was that eight game and I would have bought it. Now who knows what I'll think. Okay. Welcome to the yes, Stanley yes, Parable yes, demonstration. Your okay. number is 30. When your number is displayed, please enter the demonstration room. Oh. Thank you. We're going back to the exit. Okay, now let's take a minute to get something straight here. Okay. When you sit down to play this demo, you are assuming an amount of responsibility for its outcome. Now, I can't say for certain whether you caused us to encounter the 8 game rather than the Stanley Parable, but I think it's a pretty safe assumption that you had something to do with it. 
Ah. This time, please take a minute to think about all of the mistakes you've made in playing this demonstration, as well as your lack of respect for demo taking in general. I. Okay, I'm sorry. I mean, I I did skip it that one time you told me. Um, so far I've been going against. I mean, I've been going for the rules. Okay, I'm sorry. Goodbye. Wonderful. I could really feel the introspection on my end. I know. Now that we're all on the same page again, I feel ready to attempt the demonstration once more. In this third attempt, we shall truly come to understand the meaning of the Stanley Parable. Let the demonstration begin. Okay. I did. I wouldn't. I wouldn't. Uh, you know, according to the rules. Oh, what the fuck? It's dark. Hello. Oh shit. Oh, fuck. No, 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 it can't be over yet. You didn't see anything. Everything that was supposed to demonstrate why the Stanley Parable is a quality experience worth your time and money. It was here somewhere, I'm sure of it. Oh, no, 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 no. We have to get out of here. We have to find something for you to do, anything. The demo cannot end like this. Okay. Ah, hurry, hurry, this way. Oh, shit. I'm stuck. Okay, yes. This is new. This is different. Surely there must be a game somewhere in here. Okay, okay. Oh, how about this cup? Yes, go pick up the cup. Okay. All right. Now put it, um, um, in the bin. Ugh! <laughs> Ugh! Ugh! I'm not that good at this game, I'm sorry. Ooh. Okay. What? <laughs> Fuck. You did it! Yay! You, you know what you get for winning? An achievement. Wow. Achievement the get! The Stanley Parable just keeps getting better and better. In fact, let me take a little survey of your experience. Based on what you've played so far, would you purchase the Stanley Parable? Uh... I don't get what this... <laughs> What is this game? You what? responded. What a clear and straightforward demonstration of the merits of the Stanley Parable. I am convinced of the quality of the full game. Incredible. What? You really do get it. You understand. Oh, I was so worried. <laughs> I just wanted you to know what I see in the Stanley Parable. What I think makes it, well, special. It's so very difficult to put into words. <sighs> oh, we're all beyond that now, aren't we? <laughs> Guys are liars. Along. Let's get to the end and the final choice. Indoor magazines, but it's but it's very spacious out there. Okay. Ending, ending, where are <gasps> you? Where are you? I disagree. Hello? Is this it? Uh yes, the end. Now, this is where we want the demo to be over. And I think it's time for you to log your final decision as to whether or not the Stanley Parable is any good. And it all comes to this. Please consider very carefully before answering. Much is at stake. But I haven't... I haven't really played the demo. Nothing's happened. Oh god, I'm a little scared. I'll, I'll click yes. Is it working? I, are you sure? Yes. Are you sure you pressed the button? Fuck! What? No! We we finished the demo. Did it start again? Hello? Is anyone there? They already finished. They said they liked it. I need someone to stop the demo. Hello? We need to go back. We need to get out of here. Oh my god. Hello? I like his voice. It's kind of like Stewie. Oh my god. Oh no, what's going on? Where is everyone? Okay, over to the left. Down this way. Oh my god. What are you doing? Isolation chamber. Oh. Nice and quiet. Finally. Well, I suppose we can both agree that I failed, haven't I? Yeah. My job was to be a teacher. And I so badly wanted to teach you exactly what the Stanley Parable is supposed to be. But, but somehow I couldn't. I, uh... Well, at any rate, I don't know if I care for the Stanley Parable anymore. Do you think any of this is actually in the main game? Honestly, I doubt it. What would that even look like? No, I think I've had enough of it. 
No more doors, no more demonstrations, no more endings. That's the other problem with this game. There's too many bloody endings. I'm sick of it. <laughs> How can one game the whole end point of the game. so many times? It doesn't make sense. Oh, but back at the beginning of the demonstration, now oh, that was lovely. No concerns about where it was all going. Yeah. No confusion. Just a blank slate. Yes, that's what I want. A game of beginnings. Hey. <laughs> Do you remember? Just a few minutes ago, when we met for the first time. Yeah. And I showed you the oh. technology used to make the demo. What? Because I thought there actually was a demo. I can move. <laughs> oh, we were so naive back then. How little we knew of the world. Yeah. And then nice. when we ended up back in the waiting room, even though you'd already done that before. Yeah. Yes. It's all so fresh in my memory. They were such wonderful moments. Oh, and then when we played the game with the cup and you won, and then we kept wandering and we ended up in a stairwell somewhere. What? And we just kept climbing and climbing, flight no. after flight after flight. I thought they would never end. And then we were on some kind of oh catwalk. Oh, my God. I didn't have any idea what was down there. Did you? I don't remember any of this. And we found that elevator and it said escape on it. We talked about it for a while, about how we couldn't possibly know whether this was really an escape, but that it seemed worth a try, and at the very least it would be an adventure. So we got inside, oh. we rode the elevator up and up and up. We had some sense that the end was coming, but we couldn't possibly know when, and then after so long it finally stopped, and we stepped out into the lush outdoors, the trees, the wildlife. The sun rising on a new and glorious path. I don't remember any of this. We were free. There was nothing to think. Nothing to know. Simply us being right there in that moment. Wasn't it so beautiful? Wasn't that moment so singularly, piercingly beautiful? We were free. My God. What? Oh. So this is the game. Yay! All right. That was the demo. Yes, available on Steam, everybody. Go check it out. Hello? Is that it? Goodbye? Alright, we're at the back. Alright, that was amazing. I think I'm planning on playing the game anyways. Goodbye. Alright, guys, thanks for watching the demonstration of the Stanley Parable. Um, just going to let you know right now, it is a crappy, rainy Saturday evening, afternoon. I played the entire game already, um, it's, it's freaky, it's interesting, it's not freaky, it's not scary or anything like that, it's funny, um, so yeah, look out for the rest of these videos, I'm probably gonna put them all out there right now because it's kinda hard to, uh, stay with it unless, unless I put like a whole hour and 30 minute video out, which is not gonna happen, so uh, yeah, stick with it, and oh yeah, like, like, Comment in the section below on any other games you'd like me to play, because I'm going to play this game no matter what. Um, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and uh, peace out, and we'll see you next time.